Hello, my name is Brian Park. I'm the Master Channel. Currently, it is 18:10, March 1st, Wednesday. As you can see, as you can see, lots of snow coming in Embry-Riddle Prescott campus. It is beautiful. It is romantic. My Galaxy S21 is taking the time lapse of the snow accumulation. We are having a blast of snow, and I'm really loving this because I am born in January, and as a January person, I love snow. I uploaded the Wild Cafe food review on YouTube, so I'm gonna do the food review again. This time. It's not Wild Cafe, it is Air Hearts. The controversial Air Hearts. This is the, usually the bag you get from Air Hearts. I brought two bananas. I'm not gonna eat banana right now. This is a to go box from the Air Hearts. This is the Air Hearts food from today. This is gonna be my dinner. So we have cabbages, potatoes, some kind of a burrito, I think, and chicken. So I'll say this is a really healthy food combination because we got veggies, carbs, and we got protein. And yeah, here's my second mukbang review. I guess people like like to see me eating the food and they feel pleasure maybe, or they just want me to criticize the Air Hearts food. Well, I'm gonna criticize today if it's really bad. My roommate Toby is gone, uh, I think to his girlfriend's house or whatever. So I'm using this time again to do the food review. So first thing I'm gonna have is the burrito or I don't know what, I don't know what, what this is called exactly. Not too bad, you know. Mm -hmm. It's eatable. It's not really Gordon Ramsay five star Michelin class food, you know. It's just Air Hearts food, and you know this is actually like eatable. It's not bad at all. As you can see, there are some meat, cheese, and red pepper in it. Pretty self-explanatory. If you have eyes, you'll be able to notice. Mm. My goodness. The snow is coming really hard. Yeah, by the way, our school got canceled because of the snow. And this is um cabbage. Tastes like cabbage. Nothing really special. And the next contestant is potato. There are some things sprinkled on the potato. Salt, sugar, not really sure, but if you guys know what it is, please sh I hate dropping foods. It makes mess around it. So if you guys know what it's not a cocaine, drug, powder, or anything. It's edible. Unlike my other, my first ever mukbang video, that video had like three steps because I had three menus, but this one, I have one, two, three, four menus, but it's all in one box. So I wouldn't go through each of them because the menu is pretty simple. Next one, three pieces of chicken because I love protein and protein is good. I hope it's in focus. I believe in the iPhone 14 Pro. I mean, this is a front facing camera. My Galaxy S21 sucks at focusing the subject, but this iPhone 14 Pro is giving a goddamn good look at the chicken right here. Mmm. Mmm. I love it. Besides, this is a full of protein. It has some kind of a veggies mixed up with it. I really like this. Mmm. I can taste the herb. Maybe this veggie is consisting of some herb uh, substances. It kind of reduces the smell of the chicken's, you know, chicken's particular smell, you know? Mm. Wow. You have to watch this. It is quite beautiful. I know I showed you from the iPad, but I just want to keep showing you guys because the snow keeps coming down. According to the forecast, the snow is gonna keep coming down until 12 a.m. today. So that's pretty amazing. This is my water bottle, Hydro Flask. Got it from our Embryo Prescott campus. Have been using really well, because it has lots of volume. Put my Apple sticker, because I'm an investor to the Apple. 
and we have the this ghost face that's my uh, galaxy s21 phone protector case logo i don't know the name right now and this is a razor sticker as i'm using the death raider v2 pro razor mouse so today, March 1st, in our Embraer Presto campus, one kid is missing. He's a junior. I saw that Instagram post and story this morning from our campus, official Instagram. Missing student in our Presto campus. That's big news. I hope we find that person for sure. Okay, editor Brian Park here. The missing child, he is found and he's alive. That's a good news. Another big news. Today was a Tesla Investor Day. Event was held in Giga, Texas. I really want to visit there sometimes. I watched from the beginning to the end. One thing I really enjoyed was they were teasing us about the next generation car. The cost is going to be 50% down from the previous models. 50% reduced price and 50% reduced production price, as I remember. As a Tesla investor, this is a really great news because I'm hearing lots of news about, hey, I think Tesla is going to reveal the, the next low cost robo taxi version car the price is pretty low enough i'm actually buy it even though our Preston campus doesn't have electric charger and i think we should have an electric charger in our campus so i'm pretty hyped for that as a viewer who sees my video for the first time i'm not a food food eating youtuber i also wouldn't say i'm a youtuber right now because i'm not earning any money from it i just love making videos uh, I love to promote my Embraer Prescott campus to social media and outer world because uh, when I search Embraer Prescott campus, there's not much of a media shown. Their main promotional video was from nine years ago. Yeah, I just want to promote my campus so people can see more of it and I'll be the provider of information. Mm. I really like the burrito. Cheese, red pepper, beef, I think. Mm. Another news, currently in our Presto campus, we are doing the SGA election. Uh, SGA stands for Student Government Association. What we are doing from March 1st, March 2nd, is we are voting for new uh, vice president, secretary, organization representative, treasurer, and yeah, lots of positions. And two of my friends, Jusa and Kaya, they're really good friends of mine. Jusa is going for the secretary, and Kaya is going for the organization representative. For the last two weeks, I have been promoting them to lots of my friends. And yeah, if they get voted, I would really appreciate people who voted. I really hope Juice and Kai Martin gets voted. The result will come out tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow is the ending date and we'll know at the end of the day. And I'll let you know. Okay, editor Brian Park here. So Juice and Kai got elected. They both became successful politician and they completed their mission. <sighs> If I can make the chicken better, I would put a little bit of salt maybe and maybe hot sauce, different kinds of herb, and maybe fry more, I guess. I mean, as you can see, it's not raw. The taste I'm feeling from the chicken is right now in Korean. It's called chukum dukiada. As you can see, I hurt my thumb because this was from my AS-235 class unmanned aircraft vehicle major course. Currently, we are building a drone right now. And to build a drone, I have to I had to remove the tape from the ESC motor. We had to use the X-Acto knife, X-A-C-E-T-O knife. It's very sharp. I was going like this. I was not expecting to cut my finger, but I did. It literally made the line on my thumb. But yeah, a lot of blood came out. I had to tape it twice. This was the first injury they had in UAS lab. So I made a battle scar making the drone. I made it to the history. In my subscribers list, I hope anyone, at least one person is fan of Mandalorian because Mandalorian season three just dropped today, March 1st. And I watched it not from Disney Plus. Instead, I watched clips by clips from Real Rejects. Uh, it's a YouTube channel that mostly two YouTubers do reaction to the any videos, movies, TV shows. I watched Mandalorian season one through two from their channel. I watched Mandalorian season three, chapter one today, and the visual CGI I was amazing. As a Star Wars fan, I love Mandalorian series. I'm going to finish, but I got my Silverwing staff meeting in 13 minutes, so I have to get ready for it. 
This was my second mukbang of my whole YouTube channel history, my food review. Today I will give 6 out of 10. Chicken gets boring in my tongue as the time goes. Potato isn't that tasty at all, but it's healthy, so I'll give 6 out of 10. As you can see, I'm, I'm almost done, but I'm not quite finished yet. But as a person who does not want to waste food, I will try my best to clean the whole thing. If you are community members of Embryo Press Campus or Daytona Beach Campus, please subscribe. I will uh, upload more contents related to our or ERAU. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. It's currently 18.58. T minus two minutes until my supper was meeting. I kind of finished my dinner. Potatoes is kind of hard to eat because I'm kind of full right now. Um, yeah, I finished chicken, I finished tortillas, I finished cabbages, and yeah, there's the end of my whole A-Hearts food experience.